Dateline, 1935. Chicago, Illinois, the birthplace of the roller skate. Young entrepreneur Leo Seltzer scribbles an idea on a tablecloth, giving birth to the fast-paced sport of roller derby. Originally conceived as an endurance sport with co-ed teams racing one another for 57,000 laps around the bank track, the newfangled roller derby draws frenzied mobs of enthusiasts and packs large venues like the Big Apple's Madison Square Garden. The advent of television brings the rough and ready antics of roller derby into the living rooms of millions of Americans. By 1960, roller derby evolves into a full contact team sport with a scoring system and bone rattling hits. The 70s bring an economic downturn for the good old US of A and roller derby takes a hit and hard. Interest in the sport wanes and by the mid 1970s, roller derby rolls into the history books. making a big comeback. There's a new craze turning when housewives and working women into top It's racing, maybe you want to roll. Nationwide more. Yes, roller derby is back. Overstepped your boundaries and the amount of respect you give your skaters. I'm feeling taken advantage of by how much ranking we get. We want to restructure the leadership of roller derby. We are going to give them 24 hour to sign. I would never sign that. If they don't sign, we are leaving their company. Do you honestly think that we're going to stop because you decide you want it? This whole fucking thing that we're pulling off, they fucking.